channel today I'm gonna be showing you a day to night makeup look and I love how both of these looks turned out also in this video I partnered up with Ana Luisa jewelry I have worked with them before and I love them so much they are kind enough to keep supporting my channel and I just want to show you the jewelry that I got this time so first of all the earrings I'm wearing they're 14 karat gold and I love these so much. I paired these up with this look. Um, this was the nighttime look, and I just think it's perfect. They're really classy, very beautiful earrings. The other earrings I got are these beautiful mixed and matched hoop earrings. I love these so much. These are also 14 karat gold. They're also very light. Like these are super light. And I just love Ana Luisa because their jewelry is handmade in New York. They make very beautiful classy and high quality earrings for a very reasonable price. They are definitely worth it. Thank you Ana Luisa for partnering with me on this video and let's just get into the first look, the daytime look uh, with the mix and match earrings and yeah I hope you enjoy. So I already moisturized and I am going to be priming with the NYX Honey Do Me Up um, primer. I haven't been using this a lot but I used it the other day and it just made my makeup look so dewy. I forgot how it worked so I am going to be using this all over my face. Just working it into the skin. And I just blend whatever's left on my neck. So for foundation, I'm going to be mixing in my favorite BB cream, the Bali Body BB cream with SPF 15, and a little bit of the Benefit Hello Happy Soft Blur Foundation. And where's my beauty blender? <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I'm gonna be applying the BB cream right on my face first, because it's easier. I use a lot. <laughs> so first I'm going to be buffing this in with my beauty blender. I usually just use my fingertips for this um, because it's such an easy product, but beauty blender works fine too. So like I said, I'm going to be using a little bit of the soft blur foundation. Now for concealer, I'm going to be using the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer and I have the shade Soft Beige. I don't know, I think they didn't match me that well. <laughs> like it's a little bit dark, but it's okay. <laughs> and I'll be setting that right away with my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. Especially when you want this to last all day. Setting is a very important part of that. I'm gonna be setting my smile line as well. Now for contour, I'm gonna be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Cream Contour Palette and I'm gonna be taking this shade right here. I just use my finger, who cares? <laughs> so I'm gonna be taking a little bit of that. Also for this step, I'm going to be dampening my beauty blender with some of the Bally Body Hydrating Face and Body Mist. I really, really love this. The only thing I don't really love is um, it's not really misty. When you spray it, it's very... I don't know if you can see that, but it just squirts it out. It's not really a mist. So yeah, I love the product, but the packaging or like the spray bottle needs some work. So now I'm just going to be applying some blush and I'm taking my Milani Big Blush in Luminoso. By the way, all my brushes are from Morphe. I, 
I got this little like set so <laughs> um, yeah since you guys have been asking me where my brushes are from they're all Morphe so I'm gonna be going in with my Mary Luminizer by The Bomb Probably gonna have to blend that out a bit. Um, but yeah, that's basically what I wanted you to see. <laughs> that's a lot. <laughs> and I just, yeah, I just keep putting on some more. <laughs> I love how it hugs like your entire face so you can just drown yourself in highlight. I love that. <laughs> now, moving on to my brows, I'm just gonna be filling them in a little bit. I'm really not defining my brows that much because I've been getting them done and they look good <laughs> and just setting my brows now for this first look I'm not going to be doing anything with my eyes I'm just going to be putting some mascara because for an everyday look I usually don't do anything else so I'm going to be curling my lashes I'm gonna let my lashes dry before I set anything. Um, don't want to ruin anything here. But I really, really love this look, especially with my earrings. Aren't they just so cute, all mixed match and stuff? <laughs> but for lips, I'm just gonna be putting some lip balm on, and this is the Belly Body Coconut Lip Balm. I use them in every video. <laughs> it's pretty obvious. I'm obsessed. <laughs> so obviously you reapply this during the day. It's not gonna last all day. Mostly because you just like do this. <laughs> so we're gonna set this with the one and only Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Just a light mist. Yes. So this is the complete day look. We're not gonna be changing up a lot for the night look but you'll see what I'll do. I just love how glowy it is. Now we are turning this look into a night look and I'm also gonna be changing up my earrings. I'm gonna be wearing these beautiful little hoops. I love these ones so much because they're so classy. That's why I think that they would look better for the night look. So for the night look, say you have this look on all day um what would really be kind of disappearing at the end of the day would be um probably the contour a little bit of the highlight i'm also going to be touching up with some powder but for the night look we're just going to amp it up make it a little bit um more chiseled and i think we should make the eyes a little bit more extra um so yeah <laughs> so at the end of the day obviously uh, my contour would be a little bit less defined so i will just touch that up with my bronze booster by physicians formula taking a nice fluffy brush swirl it up a little bit um I have like a million alarms going off all day or else I don't know what time it is, okay? I'll be touching up my powder with a little bit more powder. Yeah. If I was wearing this all day, this would make more sense, but right now I'm just packing on powder. Just accentuate that contour. Well, we just use whatever highlighter is left on the brush, so spritzing that. Here we go. But I still like a natural look, even for nighttime. So that's all I'm gonna be doing right now. So I'm gonna be taking the Modern Renaissance palette and I'm gonna be taking raw sienna all over my lid. And I'm also gonna be using a little bit of Vermeer and Primavera like mixed together at the center of my lid. I did this the other day and it looks so freaking good. <laughs> it looks like my whole lid is like, I don't know, really 
really glowy and it almost it almost looks glossy actually that's what i want to say it almost looks like i put a gloss on it so if you have this palette highly recommend this combo i'm gonna kind of be blending it towards my temple that way my eye looks a little bit more elongated then like i said premier and primavera just on my finger like that and i'm just blending that on my lid it just looks so pretty oh my god and then i'm just going back to my brush to um just blend it all in and maybe i'll be taking a little bit of cypress umber just like tap <laughs> and kind of darkening it up right there at the corner for my lips for the night look i'm going to be using the nyx lingerie um gloss and this is a beautiful beautiful gloss and it is so comfortable on the lips i have been using it like crazy and you can use this even in your everyday um look but like i said even in my night looks like i like it looking uh natural so freaking glossy oh yes it also feels really nice on your lips like it feels like it's hugging your lips and almost plumping them a little bit, which I love. So this would be my night look. I love it so much. It's so easy and wearable. If you're out all day, have very minimal time to just change up your look for night, this is totally worth it and just looks so good. I hope you enjoyed uh, both of these looks. I really had a lot of fun playing around with uh, these techniques and uh, just matching these earrings to the makeup looks and just a big thank you to Ana Luisa for supporting my channel you guys know I love them I've worked with them in the past and their jewelry is just amazing you should definitely check them out everything will be linked down below so I will see you in my next one I love you guys so much and thank you for your support um, it means the world to me if you want subscribe my channel if you like my videos and follow me on Instagram to see everything else I do. <laughs> I will see you soon. Bye!